It's just a magical blend for the 2021 Cardinals. The right amount of genuine star quality with Nolan Arenado, Paul Goldschmidt, Adam Wainwright, and of course, Yadier Molina. The right amount of the youngsters finally realizing their potential. Tyler O'Neill, Harrison Bader, and Dylan Carlson. And then the role players having great moments. Edmundo Sosa, Andrew Kisner, and Lars Nootbaar. A knockout bullpen. And don't forget this, the Moselock trades. McFarlane, Garcia, Hap, and Lester. What a club, what a year. And here's the thing, too is that when these trades were made, I can remember people rolling their eyes. I can remember talk show hosts saying, why didn't they just go to the Gatesworth to sign pitchers? (laughs) But John Mozeliak knew what he was doing. I mean, Mike, think about this for a moment. This Garcia, Luis Garcia, he's 34 years old, and he throws 99 miles an hour. I think it was fitting on the day that they clinched in this improbable year that it was McFarlane and Garcia following Adam Wainwright to the mound because this is a bizarre year and picking up two guys who were dropped by their respective teams to help you clinch. Well, that sums up the 2021 Cardinals. You weren't at all nervous in those first four innings? Not at all? No. I was. I I was not tonight. Not with Adam Wainwright on the mound. Uh, Let me ask you the same thing I asked Ahmad. What do you think the strategy will be the rest of this week? Do they keep the foot on the gas pedal? Well, they have to keep their their starters sharp and I think that, you know, 17 games would look even better if it's a 22-game win streak to finish out the season. Yeah, I don't think they're going to let up. Yeah, I think they're going to go to L.A. with a big, fat winning streak. And, oh, by the way, they haven't lost a baseball game in 432 hours. <laughs> That's <laughs> amazing. Good. Yes. What a night. Frank, thank you.